The day that I have been dreading quite a bit is finally here. Shibuya incident gate close. This season of Jujutsu Kaisen front to back has been one of the greatest seasons slash arcs of anime I have ever had the pleasure of watching. And I will say the exact same thing at the end of this episode because there's quite literally nothing this episode can do to take away from that. But welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Bus and I'm very excited to get into it today. A relatively important person from Ghetto's past showed up at the end of the last one and it does feel like it has to wrap up soon because he's so outnumbered. Although the entire ice power, the person that is following under Ghetto is just kind of busted. But again, it has to wrap up somewhere and it has to do it today. Unless we end the season on a cliffhanger, which would not be cool, man. We're gonna hop right into it. Drop a fat like on this one. It does help me out quite a bit. And let's get started. You know, when the intro is before everything else, we're not messing around. What is that? Laru? That was like the conversation they had, wasn't it? What is that man? What is flying? <laughs> so Japan would be just secluded like that. A monopoly, yeah. That superpower. <laughs> Showed the US. I, it's coming back to me now, the, her conversation with Ghetto. Yeah. And what you have to do to find that goal. Panda! Oh, yeah. That, yeah okay. That seems smart. Extracting the technique. What? Oh my gosh! <laughs> Show some space! So Mahito matured in this fight and then was absorbed at the peak. Oh my gosh. This Joko, the Joko was just obliterated, no? Like, there's not a piece of him left. Two types of non-sorcerers I marked ahead of time? What? Non-sorcerers? Sumiki Fushiguro? Wait, that's right. I kind of remember that from season one, no? The whole bridge thing? Oh my gosh! He's given people power, yeah. And some inevitably will go like wild with it. Her facial expressions, bro. <laughs> oh, he's releasing it. Oh, wait. Ah! <laughs> this guy's so over it. Thousand years. Bro has the long con to end all long cons. Oh, brother! The soundtrack's going crazy! Oh, he's not even retreating. He's like unleashing hell. <laughs> Get up, man! Oh, the bugs! He's taking him! He is dipping. It's starting. Dang! The world of Han. What? What's it? What was happening? Oh. oh my gosh, that's it. That's actually it. Now we see the world react. Dude, I can't imagine the humanitarian nightmare to, to figure this out. Explain this to the residents. What's the government supposed to say? No less than 10 million unleashed. Oh my gosh. There's just gonna be war zones everywhere. What announcement? Look, it's just showing the world before it's just plunged into more chaos. The upper brass. <laughs> oh my gosh! Like, how do you explain the situation to, like, regular people? Like, the number of people in the dark on how the world actually works. Public announce the existence! Oh my gosh! You gotta let people know, bro! Oh no. It's already starting. It's already starting! Oh my god, she's gone! <laughs> the world is so boned, man. <laughs> oh my god! Bro! 
京戦闘候補地だった。法政軍特上のメラを無理やり県境まで拡張する。Oh my god, the, the long lasting implications of this season. The whole show will be different forever. The world will. It's a very、um, high def chewing sound. Oh, good. It's, she's not consuming, you know, a human. Yet. She is eating like an animal, though. Oh. How dead is she? One to ten. Oh. What? What the? Pushing thinks she's like tripping balls, man. I don't think that's true. Ah! ah! That's some like Junji Ito stuff. Oh my gosh. Oh, they're all here? Wow! <gasps> oh. <gasps> Smart kid! <laughs> you good? <laughs> Bro, this is so creepy. Don't go closer! You were so smart, you called them out lying! They were just using a corpse? That is disgusting. <gasps> Utah! Oh, shoot! He's arrived! Oh, shoot. Oh, my gosh! He's back! Oh, dude! Oh, okay, good to know. So she's using that to like scout? Who's she, who's she talking to? Me? Utah? Oh, shoot. What are the orders? Is he talking to like the upper brass? Oh, what? <gasps> oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh, bro. Jojo has been deemed an accomplice and they should be hereby expelled from JJ. What? Any attempt to free him from his seal will be deemed a crime? What? Yaga is sentenced to death for inciting Gojo and Geto, causing. What? The principal! The suspension of Itadori's death sentence is hereby revoked and his execution will be carried out properly. Oh my gosh. Yuta should be appointed the executioner. Bro, they're going full like balls to the wall. They're resetting. Oh my gosh. Gosh, how did we lose everything? Who's in Shibuya still? Who is this? Oh, his arms were cut off. I feel like this is gonna be Yuji. A new day. Shibuya is over. He's just an outcast now. The scar on his face. Bro, what does Tono think? Uh, uh, Nothing post creds either. They're not even giving us crumbs, man. That is it. The end of season two of JJK. My gosh, bro. They are setting up like crazy for next season, but without doing it in like a cliffhanger manner. But dude, now, like, first episode of next season is gonna go crazy because we'll see the fall of everything. How, like, the condition of Nobuda, if she was able to live, they said it was a small per percent chance, but I don't think they would have said that if she didn't live. What Megami and her reaction will be to. The, the, the call to execute Yuji, them realizing they need to just completely get rid of him because of everything that's happened. And like, as much as I love Yuji, especially because of the time we spent with him, I have to see from the perspective and understand why they see him like, as a liability and have to execute him. I mean, bro, Shibuya is gone. And I mean, that's kind of the whole theme though, is even Yuji kind of tackling that and trying to figure out if he should be alive in his own perspective, his own eyes. And I wonder how he feels about that following this season because he really has had no time to deal with it. Is is that why he was clapping? Is he trying to like get them to kill him? I really don't know. But is Sukuna able to just allow him to die like that? And Yuta is back. I need to go watch JJK Zero again, bro. I really do. But the the absolute sheer strength that Yuta carries has been foretold. I think Gojo said him and somebody else or like two others are supposed to be like really, really powerful. But man, just a 10 out of 10 season all around. And this episode perfectly wrapped it up while also setting up for all the chaos to follow, especially with Geto's orders and everything that he set up his long con my goodness man what a, it's, just, it's just a perfect shonen it really is but guys that's been it for my reaction to shibuya incident gate closed gojo remains sealed and things are looking very very grim that being said i hope you guys enjoyed my reaction drop a like on this one even already and i'll catch you next time peace peace